In a world governed by the unseen forces of nature and nurture, a groundbreaking discovery emerges from the shadows, challenging everything we thought we knew. Join us on a journey into the heart of human existence. Where once we believed we were prisoners of our DNA, epigenetics reveals we have the key to unlock our true potential. Through the lens of science, witness the revolution that is changing lives, empowering individuals to master their destiny beyond their genes. Dive deep into the extraordinary power of the environment and the mind to reshape our biological blueprint. Are you ready to explore how nurturing, perception, and consciousness craft the fabric of our being? Join us on this transformative quest to discover the architects of our reality. Your journey to empowerment begins now. Welcome to Quantum Mind. Traditionally, the nature side of the debate has held a strong position. It's the concept that our genes, those tiny bits of DNA that make up our genetic code, are the primary drivers of our personalities, behaviors, and even our fate. This belief is anchored in the concept of genetic determinism, a theory suggesting that our genes are the ultimate puppeteers, pulling the strings of our lives. This is the world of DNA, the spiraling double helix that forms the blueprint of our existence. From the color of our eyes to our susceptibility to certain diseases, it's been seen as the script that our life is bound to follow. Just as a caterpillar is destined to become a butterfly or a seed is programmed to grow into a tree, we too have been believed to be on a predetermined path guided by our genes. Imagine, if you will, a play where the characters have no control over their lines or actions. They simply follow the script written for them. This metaphor perfectly encapsulates the traditional view of genetics. In this scripted performance, the DNA sequence is the immutable script, and the characters, the cells and organs of our body, can do nothing but perform their roles as dictated by their genetic instructions. Just as actors on a stage, these biological components seem to have no choice but to adhere to the storyline written long before their performance began. That's the essence of genetic determinism. It suggests that we are essentially biological robots. Our behaviors, personalities, and health conditions are dictated by the genetic code we inherit from our parents. But this view paints a picture of humans as passive entities, merely acting out a genetic screenplay. It implies that we have little to no control over our destiny, as if we're on a genetic treadmill running a course that's been set for us from birth. It's a somewhat fatalistic perspective, isn't it? The notion that our genes are the directors of our life's movie, and we are merely actors playing out their script. This belief in genetic determinism has been a cornerstone of biology and psychology for many decades. But like all scientific theories, it's subject to challenge and revision. And that's exactly what's happening now. The advent of a revolutionary field called epigenetics is reshaping our understanding of the role our genes play in our lives. Contrary to the predeterministic view that our genes rigidly dictate our destiny, Epigenetics, on the other hand, paints a vastly different picture. Epigenetics is a groundbreaking field that directly challenges genetic determinism. While the term may sound complex, the essence of epigenetics is quite simple. Derived from Greek, EPI means on top of, or in addition to. So, epigenetics refers to changes in gene expression that occur without altering the underlying DNA sequence. It's like adding a set of instructions on top of the genetic code. But why is this significant? Well, it's because these changes are influenced by factors like our environment, diet, stress levels, and even our thoughts and emotions. Our lifestyle and experiences can actually talk to our genes and alter their behavior. This is a radical departure from the traditional view of genetic determinism, where our genes were believed to be the unchangeable masters of our destiny. Epigenetics tells us that our genes are more like switches that can be turned on or off. You can think of your genetic code as a vast library. Out of the millions of books in this library, which ones get read? That's essentially a simple way of explaining epigenetics. It's like the librarian who decides which books to put on display and which ones to keep on the shelves. This means that even if you have a genetic predisposition towards a certain condition, it doesn't necessarily mean that you will develop it. Your lifestyle choices and experiences can influence whether these genes are activated or not. The power is, quite literally, in your hands. This understanding shifts the balance in the age-old debate of nature versus nurture. 
It underlines that we're not just products of our genes but also of our experiences and our environment. The implications of this are profound. It means we're not merely victims of our heredity but can be masters of our destiny. Understanding the power of epigenetics gives us a new level of control over our health and our lives. It's a fascinating field that's still in its infancy, but one thing is clear, it's revolutionizing our understanding of biology, health and personal development. The rise of epigenetics is a testament to the incredible complexity and adaptability of life. It's a reminder that we're not just biological machines but dynamic beings capable of change and growth. And most importantly it's a call to action, it's an invitation to take charge of our health, our happiness, and our future. This means we're not merely victims of our heredity but can be masters of our destiny. Epigenetics empowers individuals, shifting from victims of their heredity to masters of their destiny. An empowering statement indeed but what does it really mean? Let's explore. In the world of epigenetics we find that our experiences throughout life and even the experiences of our ancestors can influence our genetic expression. This is a significant shift from the traditional belief that we are merely products of our inherited genes. Instead our life experiences from the foods we eat to the stress we endure can cause chemical changes that affect the way our genes function. What's even more fascinating is that this process begins before we're even born. Our mother's experiences, their diet, their stress levels, and even their thoughts can influence the epigenetic programming of their offspring. So before we ever take a breath in this world, our genetic expression is already being shaped by the environment we're destined to enter. But we're not merely boats adrift on genetic currents, we're captains at the helm of our own biological narrative. Imagine, if you will, that your genes are a blueprint. They lay out the possibilities, the potential, the raw material for what you could become. But it's you, the individual, who is the architect. You decide how to use those blueprints. You have the power to influence your genetic expression through your actions, your thoughts, and your attitudes. Through this lens, we're no longer victims of our genetics. We're not doomed to repeat the health mistakes of our ancestors or destined to live out the same life patterns. Instead, we're empowered to shape our own destinies, to influence our own health outcomes, and to rewrite our genetic story. The power of our minds is extraordinary. Our perceptions of the world around us, our beliefs about ourselves, they're not just thoughts. They're biochemical reactions that can alter the way our genes function. Every thought, every belief, every perception can create a ripple effect through our bodies, influencing our health, our behavior, and our overall well-being. So remember you hold the key to your own genetic destiny. Our mind and its perceptions translate into physical reality through biochemical reactions. You are not a victim of your genes but rather a master of your own destiny. Perception plays a crucial role in our life experiences and genetic programming. Let's consider this fascinating and powerful aspect of our existence. Our perceptions are not just about how we interpret the world around us. They also play a vital role in our well-being, health, and the very expression of our genes. In the vast mosaic of existence, each thought and perception adds a distinct tile, crafting a singular masterpiece. Our perceptions influence our thoughts and emotions which in turn drive our actions and behaviors, but it doesn't stop there. Our perceptions also reach deep within us right down to our cells influencing how our genes operate. In essence, our perceptions, the way we view and interpret the world, have a direct effect on our genetic activity. This is a profound realization, as it means that our subjective experiences can manifest as objective biological changes in our body. This is where the field of epigenetics shines a light illuminating the powerful interplay between our perceptions and our genetic makeup. Epigenetics show us that our genes are not rigid structures but rather dynamic entities that can be influenced by our perceptions, thoughts, and emotions. Consider the intricate dance between perception and physiological response. When you perceive a situation as stressful, it's not just an emotional reaction. Your body springs into action releasing stress hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. This hormonal cascade is more than just a surge of energy or a heightened state of alertness. It signals your cells to modify their behavior, leading to changes in how your genes are expressed. This biological shift prepares your body to confront the perceived threat, whether it's fleeing from danger or facing a challenging situation head on. This dynamic illustrates not just a survival mechanism, but a profound connection between our perceptions and our body's genetic responses, highlighting how deeply our thoughts and feelings can influence our physical well-being. But here's the real game-changer. 
If our perceptions can influence our genes, then by changing our perceptions we can potentially alter our genetic expression. This is a powerful concept as it places us in the driver's seat of our own biology. We are no longer passive recipients of our genetic inheritance. Instead, we become active participants, with the ability to shape our genetic expression through our perceptions. Our consciousness, the sum total of our perceptions, thoughts and emotions, plays a pivotal role in creating our life experiences. It's not just about how we perceive the world but also how we perceive ourselves. Our self-perception, our beliefs about ourselves, can influence our genetic expression, shaping who we are and who we become. Our consciousness thus, creates our reality. In summary, we're not just living our lives, we're actively shaping them, using the power of how we see and experience the world. Grasping the science of epigenetics brings this incredible insight to light, nudging us to take up the mantle as the architects of our own realities. But what's the mechanism behind this? Quantum physics principles provide a fascinating explanation. You see, quantum physics tells us that everything in the universe, including us, is made up of energy. Our thoughts, emotions, and perceptions are forms of this energy. They create unique energy patterns that interact with the energy patterns of our environment, including our genes. This interaction influences how our genes express themselves, shaping our physical reality. So, in essence, our consciousness, our perceptions and experiences create our reality. This concept challenges us to be mindful of our thoughts and perceptions as they play a crucial role in our health, well-being and overall life experience. Remember, we are not just products of our genes but architects of our genetic expression. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey through the world of epigenetics. We hope this video has enlightened you and sparked your curiosity about the hidden potential within us. If you found this video informative and thought-provoking, we encourage you to share it with your friends and family. By doing so, you're not only helping them understand the profound implications of epigenetics and quantum physics on our lives, but you're also contributing to a more aware and enlightened world. If this content resonates with you, please show your support by liking this video. Your likes help us reach more people and spread knowledge further. And if you're interested in exploring more groundbreaking scientific discoveries, make sure to subscribe to our channel. We regularly share content on a variety of fascinating topics that can empower you and change your perception of the world. In conclusion, remember this important message. Knowledge is power. When you share knowledge, you share power. Until our next journey of discovery, keep exploring, keep questioning, and never stop learning. Your genetic expression depends on it.